Ladies and gentlemen, now introducing the championship final in lane number one, an Olympic trials finalist in this event from Fishers Area Swimming Tigers, Jojo Ramey. Lane two, short course bronze medalist in this event at short course worlds from California Aquatics, Isabel Stannon. Lane three is your world record holder in this event from Stanford, Reagan Smith. Lane four, your Olympic trials runner up in this event from Wisconsin Aquatics, Phoebe Bacon. Lane five is your Olympic trials gold medalist in this event from University of Alabama Swim Club, Ryan White. Lane six, the ACC 200 backstroke champion from the University of Virginia, Riley Tiltman. Lane seven, a World Juniors championship finalist in this event from Commonwealth Swimming, Natalie Mangan. And in lane eight, Summer Junior silver medalist in this event from Phoenix Swimming, Kennedy Noble. This is the championship final in the women's 200 meter backstroke. About this, four of the top ten swimmers in the world this year are in the water right now, as well as the world record holder. She is one of them, four fastest in the world this year. And then you've got four ladies that are dipped under the top 40 all time in their age group ranking. So this is a stacked championship final. Right off the bat, Ryan White, the Olympic trials champion in this event, out to an early lead. That's a 29.65, almost a full second faster than she was in prelims. White second in the 100 backstroke, first in the 200 backstroke at Olympic trials. Ended up finishing fourth in both of those events at the Olympic Games. Reg Reagan Smith second, only six hundredths of a second back. And as we all know, it's really dangerous to allow Reagan Smith to be close to you as you head to the back half because she has some of the best closing speed in history. But right now the story is Phoebe Bacon who's out at a 101.49. Bacon was a 206.78 this morning, almost a best time for her, 206.40, her lifetime best. Bacon swam the second fastest time in the world this year in the morning. What does she have in store for us in the evening? Right now she looks to be leading as we hit the final 50, three women are gonna race all the way down to the finish line here in the 200 backstroke championship final. This is gonna be a close finish. Watch for Reagan Smith to try and make a move here. Phoebe Bacon trying to hold off. Here comes Ryan White as well. Reagan Smith in three, Bacon in four, White in five. Final few meters, Ryan White looks like she might be trying to make the pass. It's White and Bacon. It's Phoebe Bacon, 205.08. Ryan White with a 205.13. Ladies and gentlemen, Phoebe Bacon has just set a new US Open record in the 200 backstroke. Second and third fastest swimmers in the world right there. Both of them under the old U.S. Open record, which was owned by none other than Missy Franklin, about to approach its ninth anniversary, but not going to make it because Phoebe Bacon 
is your new U.S. Open record holder dropping 1.3 seconds off of her personal best time on her way to a event win and a U.S. Open record. Ladies and gentlemen, your new U.S. Open record holder, Phoebe Bacon.